May is Skin Cancer Awareness Month, and with a long holiday weekend approaching, it's important to remember to protect yourself if you're planning some fun in the sun. The Skin Cancer Foundation says 5.4 million cases are diagnosed annually. So today's Lauren's List has some helpful expert do's and don'ts about sunscreen and how to keep your skin safe. First, don't bother with high SPF. Sounds crazy, right? And SPF 100 seems pretty tempting. But the FDA says there's no evidence such products provide better protection against harmful rays and they may actually make us feel overconfident and less likely to apply and sometimes they're more expensive. SPF 30 is fine as long as you remember to reapply. Next, do check the ingredients. You may not be able to pronounce all of them, but you should be able to recognize these key ingredients in your sunscreen. Zinc, titanium dioxide, and avinobenzone are good UVA blockers. The Environmental Working Group says stay away from oxybenzone and vitamin A in your sunscreen if you can. Next, don't rely on sprays only. They're super convenient, but not quite as effective. If you insist on using sunscreen sprays on your body, consider sticking to lotion sunblock on your face. The Environmental Working Group says sprays don't provide an even and thick enough layer of sunscreen on skin to properly protect it. And finally, do use other forms of protection. Sunscreen is great when applied correctly, but experts say it's not proven to prevent all types of skin cancer. So cover up, wear shirts, hats, pants, shorts, whenever possible. Try to stay under an umbrella at the beach when you're not out enjoying the water. That's pretty much where I live when I'm out at the beach, under that umbrella. <laughs> What's your best advice for protecting your skin? Tell me on Facebook or Twitter. My handle is at Lauren Pastrana, and you can send future Lauren's list my way as well.